Silicon Valley is all set to witness history in the making. Come Sunday, SAP Center will host Prime Minister Narendra Modi as he addresses nearly 18,000 Indians in a throwback to New York's Madison Square Garden. The city is agog with anticipation over the high-profile visit. The mayor of the city described the visit as an opportunity for San Jose to move to the next level and to play a role on the international stage. This is extraordinary. I, I think uh, I'm looking forward very much to the Prime Minister's speech. But really, more than anything, I'm looking forward to seeing so many members of the Indian American community coming here to downtown San Jose. This is an extraordinary opportunity for San Jose and for Silicon Valley. Uh, we want to be able to showcase uh, what we're doing on an international stage and obviously having the leader of uh, the largest democracy on the planet here in San Jose is one way to do that. Nearly 600 associations of North America are hard at work to make the event a resounding success. And an indication of the enthusiasm is the fact that 47,000 people have already registered to attend the event at the SAP Center that has a capacity to accommodate just 18,000 people. Within the first two, three days, four days, the registration came to four. I mean, 47,000 people have registered. All the people who are so proud of them, they want to make it so much that there is no limit. From that, it is seen that all the people who want to come inside, all the people who want to come inside. From Nobel laureates to professionals to taxi drivers, people from all walks of life will participate in Sunday's event. From Tulsi Gabbard, the first Hindu member of American Congress to Nancy Pelosi, Nearly two dozen members of the American Congress will participate in the event. It is widely believed that Prime Minister Narendra Modi's visit to the Silicon Valley will benefit not just people of Indian origin, but will also prove to be a major boost to the technology sector. Incredibly important. It's important to San Jose and Silicon Valley. It's important certainly to the technology sector, but I think it's important to everyone that's here, especially the Indian American community. A visit to Facebook and Google headquarters, as well as interactions with top honchos of the digital world, including heads of Apple, Cisco, Qualcomm and Adobe, are on the cards. Welcoming Prime Minister Narendra Modi to Silicon Valley, Sundar Pichai, CEO of Google, on Thursday said, India has long been an exporter of talent to technology companies, but is now undergoing its own revolution that will have great benefits for the 1.2 billion people. Prime Minister Modi's Digital India vision is central to this revolution. It focuses on connecting the 1.2 billion people in India. Prime Minister Modi, welcome to Silicon Valley. We hope your visit will energize people in the valley excite Indians all across the country and renew and strengthen our partnership. It is not surprising that Narendra Modi is the first Indian Prime Minister in more than three decades to visit Silicon Valley since. Few of his predecessors were either interested in using technology in the way he has or had much to offer by way of either expertise or business opportunities. This historic visit will indeed prove to be a milestone in the Digital India Initiative boosting Prime Minister Modi's dream of using information technology to push his development agenda to new heights. With Ashok Srivastava in San Jose, Bureau Report, DD News.